Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This morning I'm sharing a Hayden Row haul, and this is two restocks worth. I ordered from the summer of 69, and then I um, ordered some more and had it held for restock, so if it seems like a lot, that's why. So I ordered quite a few loaves this round. This is Midnight Cowboy, which is a beautiful coffee with maple. Oh, so good. Pink Flamingo from the last restock. This smells like a strawberry starburst. Rocky Mountains. This one is really, really good. It smells a lot like Christmas clouds. And we have Versailles, which I believe had blue sugar, um, tonka bean. What else was in there? It's like a blue sugar vanilla sandalwood, but with some tonka bean and sweeter. This is really nice. Next up we had cashmere, which I had never seen before, but I generally like cashmere so far. This is really light. I smell a slight perfumey note, but not very strong, so I'm anxious to get these cut up and melting and see what it's like. Next up we have squeaky clean, which is exactly that. It smells to me exactly like a bar of soap or the suds when you're washing your hands. It's just so clean. Then I picked up uh, shorts and sweater. I love this. This is a great kind of warm laundry scent. It's beautiful. I actually picked up two of those. Next up we have Blue Sugar Vanilla Sandalwood. I love this. I had two of these in scoopables and I'm almost through with both of them, so I thought a loaf would be good. And this is in the Always Available section. Next we have Zen Garden. This one's like that squeaky clean. It's just a really strong, beautiful, um, fresh scent. My husband loves this. Then we have South Beach, which was ripe melon, raw sugar cane, beautiful. Then we have Flying Circus from the Summer of 69 restock. This one is strawberry and tonka bean, so nice. And we have Christmas Clouds, which again is white clouds with vanilla bean Noel. It's kind of a sweet laundry scent. Then I picked up a couple of scoopables. I got Kokomo, which I can't remember the notes on this, but it's a very fruity, um, tropical, nice smell. And I did notice Christina had made a comment somewhere about how she didn't fill the scoops all the way up, and so now they were going to be filling them all the way up, and they are very full, very nice. Then I picked up the scoopables in South Beach. I picked up King's Cross, which I think this has rose in it. This is her black label scents. I also picked up Notting Hill. I picked up Moon Landing, which was a nice fresh citrusy scent. I picked up three, four, five of the Moon Landing. Then I picked up one, two, Three, four, five of Woodstock, which was a nice patchouli scent. And then I picked up Kennedy Compound. One, two, three, four. Oh, and no, this is Taj Mahal. Four of the Kennedy Compound and one of the Taj Mahal. I really like Taj Mahal. I've had this before. This is a very... Um, floral jasmine. So that one was nice. Did get a couple of broken lids, but I always keep extra lids to swap out. I got one, two, three, four. The other one's already melting in the bedroom. Four Versailles in addition to the loaf. Um, I don't know how to pronounce that and I'm not going to try. But this was a very nice black label scent. I got one Cohiba. My sample was Kokomo, Pina Colada, 
and sand in your shorts. Um, I do not like sand in your shorts very much and pineapple is not really the pina colada one is not my favorite. There was kind of an off-putting note for me in this one. But this was my massive haul. I wanted to hurry up and get it filmed so I could cut into these loaves and put them away. Um, one of the reasons I went so big on this um, this order was because it's getting ready to be the middle of summer. It was like 102 the day I placed these orders. And I just want to make sure that I'm not ordering too much wax during the summer. I obviously have a lot to use up, but there were a couple I just didn't want to do without. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.